welcome this is the energy vibration reading for the pisces omg now pisces it is for you pisces um it is a positive week for you pisces in the sense that um it is the energy of the tower so something is about to leave your life so whatever the situation is um it is the energy of the tower okay so let's see so we're calling in um the angels and guys to show us what's coming up for the pisces Pisces, this is so wonderful and so positive for the pisces and moon horizon sign let's see this week is the energy of the tower weeks begin from the third until the ninth, we have the seven of wands. So you're standing your ground, you Pisces, against the king of wands, which is good. I'm seeing the some regrets that you Pisces have with this person. You person, you you, you Pisces have some regrets with the king of wands. Whoever this king of wands is, some judgment call is coming out. It is your week, Pisces, because the energy of judgment is here. So whatever is transpiring. I'm seeing you guys standing your grounds again this against an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius. You're really standing your grounds. I'm seeing some regret. This week has regrets and um, some judgment call is going to be coming out. But um, the energy of the Ace of Swords is that you're going to be communicating. You're going to be um, communicating by, um, you know, letting people know um, and communicating with your family. There's definitely some um, issues that is going to be coming up for you, Pisces. The energy of the Empress is here, so that is good. But you're dealing with the Queen of Swords. Whoever this Queen of Swords is, um, it can be your ex-wife. But some judgment call is coming out because this Knight of Wands has some effect on you and your family. Whatever it is, this Knight of Wands knows something about you and it's going to be connecting with maybe your ex-wife or your ex-lover because um, she's here and it has to do with a family issue this man just wants to create obstacles for you okay so this knight of wands is going to be doing something um, so um, expect that someone um, maybe you're aware of this person maybe you're not aware of this person but this knight of wands is going to be doing something against you and your family so be aware because regrets is the energy in this week and especially people who are in a relationship so with um, the Aquarian Gemini or Libra this is going to happen Pisces there is an extended reading for you guys the monthly readings are extended and moon readings are extended go pick up your extended reading it's just a dollar ninety nine and trust me it's not going to help me it is to help you guys but it is for the extra energies that I have to put in because it's a lot after I finish a reading then I have to do the extended but it is good it is just for you guys to know what is happening now let's look at these energies we have the seventh of seven of ones where you're standing your ground some of you were dealing could be in business with um, a Taurus Virgo or no an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius and this man has tried to ruin someone or ruin you okay and you're standing your grounds and said listen just back up back up because you have brought me so much illusion in my life and you have created so much illusions in my life and you have uh, ever since you have entered my life you have nearly ruined my life back up okay so that's what I'm seeing happening now we have the energy of this um, person who could be a father-in-law um, so you're going to be financially stable over this person whoever this person is it could be that you're in a relationship with this person and the person this man is going to help you to be financial stable that can be it so if you're in a relationship or you're going to be entering a relationship with a, a, um, a Aries Lee or a Sagittarius maybe this person now there is a situation so um, coming back um some of you this man could be 
I've connected with you for business or whatever or connected with you and pay you some money to do something against a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn okay and it's as if you realize that this person what he has done was injustice and you are saddened and you have regrets so what is this regrets and sadden is is about you taking some money you want to end this you want to end this because you realize that the person was too deceptive the person has created illusions and you are going to say um, you're going to end it because you're going to tell the person you know please don't contact me anymore because you have done in some injustice against someone who I really care about and now you're coming at my family and I don't need this okay so whoever this person is I think they have to pay the stars Virgo or Capricorns a whole lot of money they try to give you money or ask you to do something now when energy comes out yes um, that person has created some obstacles and hardship for someone who you know it could be your sister it could be your mom it could be your sister-in-law but whoever that man is he has created some hardship um, for this lady and now um, he has to pay her um, the ace of swords what's coming up yes success so success is coming up for you guys because you're speaking up and you're telling um, what this man has done and how ruthless this man has become and you're gonna be successful because you have seen it for yourself okay because the the, the 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 page of swords coming up is that you're going to be it's as if this man has ruined something that would have been beautiful for you um, with this um, Queen um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn um, because it's as if you have met this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn and you fell in love with this person it was someone who you were looking for your entire life and this man has lies and deceive and that sort of a thing now um, the hardship is as if he has brought not only hardship for you because you're in love with this lady but because of the lies and deception he has created this illusion around this person but that wasn't true you are now finding out the truth and if you notice it's twice the ace of swords so you have double where you are going to be definitely communicating and said listen back off I don't need you anymore in my life you came in my life you make my marriage a mess you make the friendships a mess and you have made my life also a mess and you want to release the Star Wars Virgo or Capricorn from this man and you're gonna be successful doing it because you want to return to this person that's where your love lies your love lies by the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn I'm seeing some of you having an issue with um, oopsie daisy you Capricorn you pi oh you am um, Pisces no um, you Pisces Wow um, at work it's gonna be good at work is as if you connect with you work feels like family okay some of you who are in business you're go definitely going to be good in business definitely there is the ten of cups for the Pisces what is that saying definitely oh, oh. all right so you you Pisces you're definitely there is some of you Pisces could be um, connecting with the <laughs> however way it is coming up for you Pisces a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn could be your mom for some of you and your father could be the Aries Leo or Sagittarius and whatever your father has done to your mom has created a lot of obstacles it could be a father it could be a stepfather whoever this person is has created like some hardship for your mom it could be for a girlfriend it could be for your sister but here is a younger Taurus or Virgo that is coming in and you want to connect with this person whoever this person is I'm seeing this the situation where um, you want to connect with them in business and but this is a younger version than this version this version is a really permanent person this version is that you want to make a family with this version okay this is a younger Taurus Virgo or Capricorn now 
I'm receiving the message oh is this reading for men or only for women it is for men and women so it can be vibrating on the same masculine feminine and energies okay the Empress what is that coming in oh justice justice is coming up so um, some of you were having some issues so, um, with your business you are going to be um, this is going to be resolved some of you were having issues with your business partner this is going to be resolved some of you had issues where someone has created some real hardship and it is going to be resolved a new love is coming in okay so some of you could be getting divorced um from the queen of swords and you want you could be getting divorced from the queen of swords you could have been in a relationship with the queen of swords and you want it you you're you're thinking to go back um or to reconnect with a pisces cancer or scorpion now this lady is um older than you are but you were you fell in love with this lady um and this lady is like an empress it's like she is nurturing she's beautiful inside out um, there was some injustice um, that come up against your business and now this is being resolved and I'm seeing love coming in for you so the Queen of Swords is here what um, is it with the Aquarian Gemini or Libra with the Pisces um, because she's not looking so happy <clears throat> some of you definitely um, you could be in business with her or you were married to her um, seeing this divorce coming through um, some of you could have been um, married to this person and find out that this person has done something injustice to this Queen of Pentacles or injustice to this other um, uh, princess of Pentacles which are Taurus Virgo or Capricorn um, some of you could realize that these two have worked to, to um, um, block your relationship okay but there's fate and hope there is definitely fate and hope not fate and hope um, some of you might want to reconnect with an Aquarian Gemini, um, Aquarian Gemini or Libra not the good thing to do it's all about money for this woman okay so just just understand that the only way this woman wants to connect with you it's all about the money okay it's all about the dough um, some of you wants to some of you are getting married or wants to connect with a younger Pisces cancer or Scorpio uh, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn it can happen okay some of you are hoping that you can work out a situation with an older Aquarian Gemini or Libra which could be your mom because this is the month of working out issues with your parents this is coming up um, whatever the issues was this is coming up if you're a businessman your business is going to be doing very very well um, you could be getting news if your child is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn some positive news is going to come out for your child um, especially at school success and that sort of a thing moving forward positive energy positive situation I'm seeing the end of uh, some disappointments in your life and you're speaking up against an injustice that has transpired with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn okay it's a beautiful week there is so many messages that is coming up for you guys um, but some of you really um, want to dissolve a relationship with an Aries with Leo or a Sagittarian person it could be a father-in-law it could be a brother whoever it could be a business person but whatever it is there's this lady comes in that is a Taurus Virgo or Capcom so this is coming up as modified issues that needs to be resolved and you're pissed off with your father if it's an Aries Leo or Sagittarius because of what a hardship they have brought your mom in or your sister in or whoever this person in because you have love for this person whoever this person is you have love for this person whatever the issue is with this person this person is getting out of all those issue and you're going to want to return to this person 
by getting out of the issue you're going to be one to return to this person now there is definitely that some of you wants to go in business connect um, in a family way um, it could be that you and your partner you might be married to a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn because this person is, is connected to you family wise and you want to go in business with this person it could be successful because you're having two energies here which is very successful so nine it could be the end of um, a relationship with this young person the end of a business situation with this young person um, which is a Taurus very very Capricorn but if this person is your child she's definitely going to be successful and excel excelling in school and this is very good I'm seeing success coming up because you spoke up for some injustice so you guys have twice the nine and twice one okay so I'm seeing really um, some of you are going to be finding out that this Aquarian Gemini or Libra whether you know you want to find a balance in a, you, you're hoping to find a balance to work together with this person but um, to be honest which is the energy of judgment that came out with the nine of Pentacles it's all about the money okay her interest in you is all about the money make a decision do you want to go for someone who is going to be um, very protected very loving um, and focus on building a relationship with you or you want to go back and try to figure out and um, try to heal something that isn't there because you want to have a balanced relationship with this person but it's all about the money they're not in love with you anymore the love has left and um, was the love ever there that's another question but the love has left it's all about money for this person business wise you're going to be very good so whatever is happening business wise is going to be good the energy for you guys x-ray vision so you Pisces in this week is going to be having some real good you're going to be seeing the truth of things okay because when x-ray vision comes up that mean you're hitting your intuition is right on target okay so ignore everything in your life that suggests that there is a problem it's a time to look past the illusion and the veil of his illusion and the struggles as soon as you take your attention off the wrong will disappear and you will begin to notice all the sort of new signs and light that is coming up the universe is throwing a bucket of clear guidance your way see beyond the surface and the superficial stuck in the deep and sought out in the refreshing water of the truth so that is what the x-ray vision is going to be doing for you guys and trust me you Pisces is going to see through everyone everything wait okay this comes up when they say wait that means it's not a right time so some of you might want to work on a situation with uh, an uh, and Aquarius Gemini or Libra wait no it's not the right time wait 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 no it's not the right time also some of you might want to go in business with a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn or in a relationship no wait, it's not the right time depends on who you are and what is happening first you need to end something before you can start something ladies and gentlemen thank you for being here please like share as you're busy um, the videos really you know I'm some of you are going to be speaking up and letting someone know how you feel about them some of you are going to be speaking up for yourself and be very very successful namaste